Hi everybody, Andy here with eTrailer.com and today we're going to take a look at this D-Max Galvanize Trailer Idler Hub. Now this marine grade trailer hub assembly is going to fit your 8,000 pound trailer idler axle with number 42 spindle. The long wheel studs are going to let you pair this with an over the hub brake rotor for disc brake applications or a custom wheel with a thick mounting face. This does feature a galvanized steel construction that is durable but also corrosion resistant. So this is going to be great for use on your boat trailer or your snowmobile trailer. And the oil bath is going to let you check the lubricant level without taking the hub apart. You're just going to simply look through the clear oil cap, which is sold separately, to check the lubrication levels. Now the bolt pattern on this assembly is eight on six and a half inches and the wheel stud dimensions beginning with the diameter is five eighths of an inch in diameter and then three and three sixteenths inches long. The oil cap flange diameter is 2.875 inches and the weight capacity is 4,000 pounds so when this one is matched with the one on the other side of your axle, it will meet your 8,000 pound axle capacity. Now this does include the races that are pre-installed, as I'm showing you here. However, the bearings and the oil seal and the oil cap, as I mentioned before, are sold separately. And so you would have to pick those items up if you don't have them already. But I do wanna give you that information Beginning with the bearings, as you can see there on your screen, the inner bearing is 25580. The outer bearing is 02475. And then as I mentioned, the races are already installed and the inner race is 25520. And the outer race is 02420. And then the oil seal is 10-63. Now if you check the related products section on this product page, you will see those items such as the bearings, the oil seal, and even um, the oil cap that is recommended to work with this assembly. So you can just uh, take a quick look at um, uh, the related product section and that, those will give you direct links to the bearings and the oil seal and the oil cap. Now I weighed this before our time together, and this weighs about 16 and a half pounds. And that's going to conclude our look today. I do hope that it was helpful for you. Again, my name is Andy. Thank you for joining me.